I want to use the noise of the chopper to keep these cattle moving. Sometimes I do have to get down low and put the pressure on to move the more stubborn ones. There's always one that won't play the game. I've just got one, he's, he's broken back here. I'll just slip down and, and see if I'll push him back into the main mob. This is the trickiest part of the job, getting them through the final gates and into the yard. Easy. Push him into the yard. Too much pressure and the mob will turn on me. Oh, it looks like the main mob's sort of turning around. I'm going to have to put a bit of pressure on them. They're coming back, coming back. Right, I'm going to put a bit of pressure and see if we can get you guys to hold, hold that line. And... Rightio. Work them right, nice and steady, and you'll get them where you want them. Hey, we got one cow stuck in the mud. It's pretty crucial we get her out. She stays there. Crocodiles are going to grab her and eat her. So Mick's going to come over the sling. I'll hook her up, pull her out. I'll get around her front shoulders. Yeah, just drag it, eh? I want to get in and get out as quick as I can. Crocodiles are around here. Lift her up. Roger. This might seem like a lot of work for just one cow, but they're worth about 500 bucks a head, and each one will breed more cows. Beef cattle ranches, we call them stations, cover thousands of square miles across Australia's outback. It's big business. <laughs> 